Art speaks where words are unable to explain. Greetings, Honorable Principal Sir, Respected Vice Principal Miss Meena Malhotra, Head Mistresses Miss Poonam Sondhi, Dr. Sunita Gehani, Miss Neelam Ahuja, Chief Coordinator Miss Sapna Behel, Dear Parents and My Dear Students, A Warm Welcome. It infuses us with feelings of pride and gratification to take you on a virtual safari of our online art exhibition, Creative Hands. Quote, Every child is an artist. Unquote. Pablo Picasso. World-renowned, most inspiring and influential artist of all times. Unbinding the artist in them, students of class 4 and class 5 have created a virtual space to showcase their artistic creations from the confines of their homes during these unprecedented times. The themes and ideas in the virtual art gallery cover four domains depicting beautiful hues of nature and expressing solidarity and empathy for our frontline workers. The four domains, pointillism, corona warriors, nature study and life in the lockdown. Our students will now guide you through a wonderful sojourn of our art ensemble. Welcome, respected principal sir, vice principal ma'am, chief coordinator ma'am, teachers and my dear friends. I am Hanika Jindal, student of class 5F, want to start with a quote of Pablo Picasso. Art washes away the soul, the dust of everyday life. It's enough to understand the importance of art in the life of an individual. We, the students of class 4th and 5th, present you mesmerizing journey creative hands one of the first of its kind in the history of bbps i welcome you all to experience an incredible and unforgettable moments captured by little creative hands of balbharti public school gangaram hospital mark in this present exhibition we will witness four categories pointillism, corona warriors, life in the lockdown, and nature study. I welcome my friend Kashri Jain of class 5A to express a few words on pointillism. Thank you. I'm Kashri Jain of class 5A. Here to present the first category of our exhibition that is pointillism. Pointillism is a technique of painting where dots of colors are applied and optical mixing occurs when we view the painting. George Seward is the founder of this technique. He was born in 1859 Paris in France. He painted using dots of colors directly on the canvas without mixing the paints. La Grande Jet is one of the most famous paintings made by him. It consists of 34,56,000 dots and its size is 81 inches by 120 inches. This painting is made by using only the primary colors. By using this dot technique, students of class 4th and 5th create beautiful images. They create their own image. Some of them with their imagination and some of them with references. My friends used sketch pens, watercolors and brush pens to create dots in their painting. They used vibrant color combinations which made the painting more beautiful and attractive. Small, small, tiny dots create the whole painting.
hope you like this part of our exhibition. Now I invite my friend Nidhan Chaudhary to pay gratitude towards Corona Warriors. Everyone, I am Nidhan Chaudhary of Class 4B. Here to present the second category of our art exhibition, Corona Warriors. Not all heroes wear capes, but they wear PPE kits. I just wanted to take a moment to say thank you to our Corona Warriors. This part of exhibition is a tribute to our great Corona Warriors who are fighting day and night without getting tired. In these hard times of pandemic globally, these Corona Warriors are serving the humanity selflessly. We all have tried to show our emotions and express a thankful gesture by using different variations and different medium of colors using oil pastels and watercolors. We have made freehand drawings, dot paintings and posters on our real heroes. We are showing our creativity in front of you to say a big thanks direct Dil Se. I hope you acknowledge our work. Legion of Class 15 here to present the third category of our art exhibition, Life in Lockdown. Lockdown becomes the new norm throughout the globe. In my pajamas or from my bed, oh I need to rush with my own trend. No morning assembly, no traveling stream. Just brush my teeth, I'm ready to be trained. One after the other, oh I could not retain. Someone again poked, hell, whole lecture went in vain. Ma, where are you? I can't see you anymore. Audibility is almost zero. Could only hear few footsteps on the floor. With my tired eyes and my numb brain, I was supposed to clean my room after the online game. One thing I had enjoyed throughout was a scrumptious corn soup full of vitamin C, pure delicacy in a loop. No more parties, no more malls to roam. But the one thing I had enjoyed throughout was my father all time home, sanitizing all day long, wearing whole day mask, one hand social distancing was the most difficult task. Still I had enjoyed each moment of lockdown, video call celebrations and one feather in my crown. Talent I had discovered, so vivid and so kind. Now I could create a poetry out of my exceptional mind. Thank you. Students of class 4 and 5th express their emotions, creativity and visuals which they observe during the lockdown using different color mediums like oil paste, watercolor, poster color, etc. I hope you acknowledge our work.
Hi, my friend. Samaila Nagpal to express few words on nature. Thank you. If you love of nature, well that is true way to understand art more and more. Beautiful lines by Vincent Van Gogh. Good morning respected teachers and my dear friends. I am Samaira Nagpal of class 4 B here to present the last category of art exhibition that is nature study. Nature is the perfect example of beauty and aesthetic. The relationship between nature and art has been existing since early humans even this scratched first tablets on cave wall. We closely look at nature. It's an art examining different colors and shapes of birds, flowers and observing the effects of light and different moments or noticing the ways a landscape can change over time. Artists find inspiration in nature. We students have served a purpose beyond beauty. Students have addressed topics about conservation, biodiversity and threatened habitat etc. on canvas by using different mediums of colors. Art can spark or help connection with nature. My name is Ryan Sindhi and I am from class 5th B. Today I will be sharing my views on art with you. I love art because it stimulates my imagination and helps me to draw pictures with pencil colors, crayons and paint brushes. I love mosaic painting the most because it is wonderful to see small shapes combine and form a beautiful picture. Thank you. I enjoy doing it and I could find it in my daily life. I love art by drawing, coloring, by observing the nature's beauty. Just like sunset, sunrise, butterflies, flowers and also by sketching. Thank you. I love art because it boosts my creativity and enhances my imagination. Also, it has crafting, which is very fun and exciting. My favorite artist is Leonardo da Vinci because he has painted a very famous and beautiful painting named Mona Lisa. For me, it is good for the soul. It makes me question things, the sublime and the mundane. It stirs our emotions. It is the only thing that gives me peace in all the negativity around us. In my opinion, there are many great artists, but Vasudev Kamath's paintings are a poetic treat to your eyes. I love art because art is everywhere and in everything. It is the nature concentrated. My favorite artist, Leonardo da Vinci, says, Art is the queen of all sciences. 
communicating the knowledge to all the generations of the world. Hello everyone, I love art and paintings a lot. My favorite art is pastel color art. I feel relaxed while doing it. It is a real stress buster for me. My favorite artists are Pablo Picasso and Leonardo da Vinci. Some of my favorite paintings made by them are Sweeping Moment and The Mona Lisa. Thank you. I am a vision of class with C. In my opinion, life without art will be dull and uninteresting. Art is a form of expression from one person to another. I love to do painting in art and my favorite artist is Andy Warhol. Thank you. We are surrounded by art and without it, the human race will not be as you know it. Art is a universal language and its importance in our daily life is undeniable. I love art because in any form, it can give people emotions that can lift up their spirit and make them more driven than ever. Every piece of art is a result of human imagination and Artist's perception. Art gives shape to one's thoughts and it is a medium to materialize one's thoughts. Art helps us to express ourselves. I found me when my office loves art because it helps to express my thoughts. It enhances my creativity and also communicate on a bigger scale. It also helps in rejuvenating and relaxing my mind. I like to learn new forms of drawings and incorporate them in my creations. Art adds creativity and positivity into day-to-day -day life. It makes our world beautiful and happy. Why I love art? It keeps me involved and calm. I can share my thoughts through my drawings and it makes me feel good. I love art because it is very fascinating. It is the best way to release thoughts on a canvas. If I draw anything, I feel very happy by expressing my thoughts colorfully. I see art is everything that is even scribbling, doodling and much more. Art is important because it improves our creativity, it gives us joy, and it relieves stress. It gives us opportunity to showcase. Hello friends, I am Jadis. I love to draw things and paint them with beautiful bright sunshine colors. Art fills me with joy, enthusiasm, and gives me great pleasure. In today's pandemic times, Art is one of the best ways to keep oneself engaged and create. And it is medicine for our mental health also. Thank you. We are surrounded by art and different forms like painting, music, comedy. All kinds of art that present our mood in a positive way, making us feel happy, calmer, or even inspired. A picture is a poem without words. Horace, good morning everyone. I want to congratulate all the participating students of Creative Hands for insightful and soulful visual journey. It is a great pleasure for me as an art teacher to showcase the creative expertise of budding Picassos of Bal Bharti Public School, Sargangaram Hospital Mark. Quote, a simple line painted with the brush lead to freedom and happiness. Unquote. Paul Klee, line by the famous artist, becomes the key inspiration for the students of class 4 and class 5. They try to document their time and environment and celebrate with color of hope in a positive manner in the hard times of pandemic. Art plays an important role in the life of an individual. 
it helps to understand life around us and serves as psychological peace and blissfulness to the society. Art helps in our intellectual growth. It guides our overall development and improves our physical and mental personality. Art gives a soul content to the society and provides cultural richness. It acts as an encyclopedia for young generations to understand the life and culture in the history. I appreciate students of class 4 and class 5 for their sincere efforts and aesthetic expressions. Thank you. Heartfelt gratitude to our Honorable Principal Sir Shri L.V. Sehgal for being an inspiration and guiding light behind all our endeavors. Constant encouragement of our dearest Vice Principal, Ms. Meena Malhotra, is highly appreciated, as is the support of our Chief Coordinator, Ms. Sapna Bell, who conceptualized this virtual event and saw it to fruition. We thank our art teacher, Ms. Satvinder Kaur, for coordinating and organizing this one-of-a-kind virtual exhibition. This expression of gratefulness would be incomplete without thanking our ever-supportive members of the Parent-Teacher Association, parents and loving, hard-working and spirited children who put their heart and soul into all the activities organized by us. Your enthusiasm and sincerity are worth an applause. We are sure that you will keep working with the same earnestness, exuberance and gusto. Let your creativity and imagination help you scale greater heights. Stay safe. Take care.